Hello, this is Michael Leitz. We are today, uh, February the 12th, 2021, and we have uh, big news in the crypto world. So that's why I called it breaking news today. And uh, what I've seen is really amazing. So we're going to see. First, uh, Mastercard is going to accept cryptocurrency payment. Miami mayor is going to pay salary in bitcoins and the first bitcoin ETF is approved in Canada which is really big so all of this is a good sign that cryptos are going mainstream this year so news number one and it's a big one Mastercard is going to accept cryptocurrency payments this is a big news so we are now on the official website of Mastercard and then uh, we're going to see what they are saying so basically they was just observing what's happening and then they seen there is uh, more and more crypto cards uh, debit cards so that the people can uh, use the cryptos to payment with a card like mastercard or visa so it was uh, the first thing they seen and it was growing more and more people wanted to do it so they say okay now we're going to offer a new service to our merchant they can accept cryptocurrency payment if they want and if they uh, customer want so which cryptocurrency we don't know at the moment what they are saying they want to be secure digital currency and not all of them are secure at the moment and then uh, so they say they want to accept first payment in stable coins which is really good I think because the price women stable it's easy to handle for merchants they can convert into fiat or not or they can spend it directly so this is good then all the crypto will come we will see but this is really good news and uh, I think it's very interesting what they are saying we are here to enable customer merchant and business to move digital value traditional or crypto so both however they want it should be your choice it's your money so this is good and then uh, they're going to do it this year we're going to see they already see saying also they are in a negotiation or in the testing to uh, provide services to central banks which want to issue digital currency so central bank digital currencies and they have a lot of patents already so everything is ready and uh, this is big because there are so many customers using uh, mastercard in the world so if now they can pay with cryptocurrency di directly without converting to uh, from cash from crypto to fiat so this is really big this is a big step and i was waiting for a long time for this to happen So news number two, a big one, it's a big step uh, forward for cryptocurrency adoption. So the Miami uh, council, the, the mayor, is offering a city worker possibility to be paid in Bitcoin if they want. Let's hear what he's saying exactly. I want to thank the city of Miami commissioners for supporting my resolution, which directs the city manager after analysis to procure a vendor to be able to offer our employees to get a percentage of their salary in Bitcoin, allows our residents to pay for fees uh, in Bitcoin, and also would allow uh, the city manager to cooperate with Miami-Dade County to allow for taxes to be paid in Bitcoin. It also a request of the state legislature that uh, the city of Miami supports efforts to make Bitcoin uh, an acceptable currency for us to potentially invest in in the future. Um, it's a wonderful uh, to be a very crypto forward city in the city of Miami. And I want to thank my commission colleagues for allowing that to happen. So this is quite big because he's saying 
the people from the employees from the city they can choose to be paid in bitcoin first then uh, the resident can pay fees in bitcoin can pay tax in bitcoin and the merchant in the city can accept cryptocurrency so bitcoin as a payment which is big and also speaking about investment kind like uh the city maybe is going to buy some bitcoin as an investment so this is really a big news and i'm really happy that uh, some people are moving the things forward and uh, this is one of the first but uh, it will be another and another and it's going more and more so this is really good for bitcoin and for cryptocurrency so news number three also big one it's the first time and north american bitcoin etf is approved in canada so not in usa but it's uh, something is better than nothing and the uh, sec from canada has approved the bitcoin etf and now it's possible for investor from all canada to buy this etf which is big because anyone who has a trading account most people have it in the bank they can go there search for this etf and then invest into bitcoin it's not a direct uh, investment in bitcoin it's an instrument which replicates the performance and the price of bitcoin minus the fees and expense of the product but is really good because anyone can buy it and then take advantage of the bull run of the price going up from bitcoin without buying in the any cryptocurrency which is still a bit difficult for the normal people so this is good it's the first time this is happening there was a lot of attempts it was always rejected so this is really good and uh, it's another sign that the crypto adoption in this year is going massive and it's going to be really a good year for cryptos so that's all for today it was already a uh, big news i think uh, this is a good sign that uh, this year is going to be big for cryptos price are going to be very high and uh, adoption is coming and this is a good thing first year i've seen this in the five years i've been in crypto so this is really good i'm really happy so please like and subscribe to my channel so you can get always the news click the bell to never uh, miss any videos and if you want comment in the comment section below share if you like with your friends and tell me what you think do you think uh, 2021 is going to be a big year for cryptos we're we going to see adoption or not tell me what you think I'm always interesting to see what uh, my viewers are thinking about. Thank you and see you in another news video very soon.